Well, howdy. <laughs> Dust off your boots and get ready to get it up. Because Cowboy Core has made itself somewhat of a comeback ahead of Queen Bee's new album, which is out tomorrow. You are enjoying this Woo! part too much. <laughs> to show us how to dress the part, we are joined by fashion expert Donnie Galea here in studio. Morning, good Donnie. Morning. How are you? Very good. Okay, this is all Queen Bee's fault, but we love it. Oh, We're leaning in. Um, we are just in. how big is the Cowboy Core trend right now? It is enormous. Going by Google searches, up by two, three hundred percent for things like these yeah. cowboy hats and boots. It is absolutely extraordinary. That so, okay, hats, effect. obviously, that's a must-have. Okay, so what cowboy, are our core pieces that okay, we need? Core pieces. The, the Holy Trinity is a cowboy hat. Holy Trinity. <laughs> the cowboy hat. <laughs> yep, a nice yep. cowboy belt, so a nice big buckle, mm. and the boot. You the must boots. have a boot. Absolutely. And where are we finding these items at the moment? Because they haven't always been yeah, mainstream exactly. available, have they? So I'll talk you through. I've got some items. So David's bolo tie, I found that at a vintage shop. So shopping vintage oh, is yeah, great because it's great. more affordable that's and awesome. you can find some great unique well, pieces. Carson. Now. Uh, yeah. But these, a lot of these are from my local Westfield. So these hats are from Sports what? Girls. Your hat's actually made by Sydney Miller, embellished millinery. Oh, um, and these man. boots a are a mix of like, you've got Maya, spinless shoes, Can we uh, just talk ASOS. about this one with the <gasps> embellishment oh, underneath? Oh, are you oh, kidding? I Hiding know. that on the plinth? Yeah, I love that. that. You were saying yeah. Beyonce's track listing has a song called Levi's it on does. it. I wish I had shares in that now. I yeah. know. That is it. Levi's sales are about to go through the I love roof. Levi's. Yeah. Talk us through some of those Western looks then in terms of you know, what we're head seeing. to toe. Yeah. Here's what some I prepared earlier. So obviously the Western shirt, so, you know, all that beautiful Western details on the shirts, oh, yeah. cool shirt love detailing that. there. Love that. I, that. I know, I love that. There you go. Oh, I can see this. you in that, DC. Yeah, I love this. Perfect. Love all these. Yeah, and then, like the man in black. <laughs> can we just have a moment for the denim? So these are oh. like a chap jeans having a moment. Inbuilt. So they're fun. So don't even and have the bumps cut out. This obviously if you're wearing boots, you're going to need something that go with your boots. So flares are back. So they're a little to Cuba. Oh, flare. Yeah, like a boot the boot cut, cut jeans. Yeah, and the boot cut. So your so your boots and your jeans can Goodbye, live in skinny harmony. Goodbye, skinny jeans. Goodbye, skinny jeans. And you know the thing about like flares. Levi's is that when I went, I got some Levi's recently. So I'm like, I felt a bit retro and a bit cheap and daddy. The cost of Levi's. Mate, it's so affordable. It's yeah, so good. It's, good price point. It's so if you're doing cost of living table. version of this, you can go like op shopping and go to Levi's and go for Beyonce. What influence is this having on the local fashion scene though? You know, Melbourne oh, Fashion yes. Festival happened recently. Did you see yeah, some I was of the there, and there was an uh, Aussie label called Rainer. DC, I found your Logie suit. All, right. All the suits that came down had, had a Western flair. I think we might have some footage and photos. Show me some beautiful shirt. Western shirts, Western suits, no, the hats. Um, so we're definitely that's seeing it infiltrate on our that. runways. So. I'm not wearing that. That's I'm certainly not wearing well, that. Wear that. Maybe the belt. Yeah. <laughs> that looked like a <laughs> spot. I mean, different... Kim Kardashian's on the trend, so we know it's going to be big, right? Oh, my oh, Lord. That. So where else are we seeing this Western influence? So, I mean, like I said, you could walk into any store right now at your local Westfield and see, you know, your shirts, your jeans, or having that Western vibe coming in. Um, I think my, my prediction, Melbourne Cup this year, these hats. No way. It's going to be. Well, yeah. you were amongst horses. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Of course. Well, yeah. Makes sense. <laughs> Why wouldn't you? It makes sense, Kevin Costner. Yeah. Thanks so much. <laughs> Very well, good. Well, we're going to go dances with horses to the break. <laughs> Donnie, thank you so much for coming in. Yeah. We'll be right back. Thank you, Donnie. Thank you, Donnie. Hey there, today fans. Sarah and. <laughs> What's my name again? Oh my God. Carl. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching our YouTube <laughs> channel, though. Subscribe now for more news, special reports, and amazing Aussie stories. And Carl misbehaving, Whoa, of course. That never happens. Always happens. What's she talking about?